I'm Mark Douglas from 680 News on Jane Street, not far from Highway 400. We have a scene here that's a whole new level of brazen violence in Toronto. A daytime shooting, 11:15 in the morning. The 911 calls started coming in. You can see what's uh, you can see the level of damage here. The glass door of the convenience store here is shot out. There's a bullet hole in the uh, window of the residential unit above the store, and then we have this car crash right here in the middle of Jane. Bullet holes in the windshield. The passenger side window of this gray car has been uh, shot out. Witnesses who saw and heard this describe a scene of violence and chaos. They were just shooting at each other, and then some guys went running and they crashed into uh, that some lady that was there driving. The first three shots, I I thought um, they were like firecrackers or whatever, but it just kept going, bang, 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 and. Um, uh, those are gunshots, and um, that doesn't happen around here. Toronto police have, of course, been interviewing witnesses and gathering all the surveillance camera footage they can find from this area. They finally managed to piece together the sequence of events here of exactly what happened. It was two groups of uh, males at that trip plaza, and at some point they became involved in some kind of dispute. And that dispute escalated into where both groups pulled out firearms and began shooting at each other. One of the uh, groups jumped into the vehicle that's behind me and attempted to flee uh, as they pulled out onto Jane Street. They struck a vehicle here that's unrelated to the gunfire. Uh, their vehicle became disabled and they fled on foot. The other group fled in another vehicle. At this point, we haven't had any uh, reported injuries, thankfully. Now, police have recovered one weapon from the scene here, but only one. They know there was more than one used, so somewhere out there are suspects who are still armed and considered very dangerous. Police know that there are five suspects they're looking for, described only as males wearing dark clothing at the time. On Jane Street near the 400, I'm Mark Douglas.